Hi guys, uh, today we are going to discuss some theorems about policies, right? Did you have learned these things before? Suppose we have a power series centered at C with ra radius of convergence R, right? So, and assume that F is the uh, representation of that power series, right? So that if, if there exists a function representation for that series, that function is differentiable in this interval, right? So if you differentiate that power series one by one, one term by one, so the so so we get another power series something like this, right? This is the dif di differentiation of that power series one by one. So 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 F prime represents this theorem says F prime represents that this power series here with the same radius with the same radius with the same radius which is very important right right So we can discuss this corollary as well, right? So suppose uh, we have a power series centered at C with radius of R, right? And, and F is the representation of that power series in this interval, right? Then you can differentiate this power series any time or k times so you can differentiate that power series k times right so we get another power series like this so so f prime f k derivative represents that power series here the radius of convergence of this power series does not change. Get the same radius of convergence, right? So from this corollary, right? So you can show that, you can show that, you can show that these co coefficients of this power series, these co coefficients, is same with that coefficient is same with and uh, f n derivative at c divided by n factorial for all n. I think you should I think you should prove this result, which is very easy. I will help you to prove this one. Right, and the next. Theorem says if you have two power series uh, centered at C, something like this, this one and this, right? Having the same radius of convergence R. So assume that F represents this power series in this interval and G represents other power series in the same interval, right? If f and g functions are the same for all x in this interval, then we can show that a sub n, a sub n is same with b sub n. That means get the unique so this is the uniqueness of power series, right? So this can be shown very easily. Give it a try. I will help you to prove this these theorems, right? Next theorem says if uh, suppose we have two power series with different radius of convergence, say this. This is a power series centered at C with this radius R sub 1 and this one is another power series with this radius, right? So 
So F represents this power series and in this interval, right? G represents the other power series in this interval. Then you can add these power series, right? So this relation is true uh, when x in between the minimum of R1 and R2, right? This is very important if you want to add two power series. That converges this one, sum of those two functions or substrat of f and g, right? But this one converges to this one in in this into x x minus c less than or equal minimum of r1 minimum of r sub 1 r sub 2 right this is very important you can you can multiply two those two power series power series right in the same manner right f so this power series converges to this function product of f and g in this interval this one is very important minimum of r1 r sub 1 and r sub 2 i think you can answer this these kind of problems right so if is given here so if it's defined so so you have to check whether there exists a power series like this uh, with the radius of r and f is equal to this power series in that radius so i think you can do this problem now right so give it a try. I will help you to do this one. All right.